Have you ever wanted to know how to make animations in the free drawing program known as Fire Alpaca? But like you just don't know how to do it and you really feel like you want to kill yourself and jump off a bridge? Well, well, I have the perfect video for you. Yeah, you! The one in front of me. I will teach you how you can animate in Fire Alpaca. So just sit back, relax, get some popcorn, and bring your family with you too. Hello everybody, it's your boy JD and welcome back to another video and today I'll be teaching you how you can animate in Fire Alpaca using Fire Alpaca <laughs> so basically um, just doing traditional animation not flash animation because I don't know how to do flash animation and uh, I can't afford Adobe Flash and yeah you're just gonna do it um, using the traditional way and you want, if you want you can turn on on in skin mode on the V tab right here and basically we just want to draw frame by frame each layer represents a frame so basically you just want to keep drawing and drawing over these lines and make the ball move towards somewhere I'll, uh, I'll be making a bouncing ball and just make it bounce to the other side and um, I'll get back to you when um, this is done. I'll fast forward with this so you don't have to watch it the whole process. Okay, so now we're done with that. We just want to export layers and then pick the folder that you want to save it in. And I'm just going to choose um, with no backgrounds. Uh, I mean, no transparent background. So it's not just transparent and the orange ball. And it should save in this file right here. Um, I'm just gonna wait until it finishes. After it's down, we're just gonna take. It's gonna ask us to go to a website, which is um, for Alpaca Doga, and in the bottom there is uh, make the GIF, and I'm just gonna open the file that I want. So I want to control A every little frame and just um, insert it into the web page. And th these are the frames, which is going to load in a bit. And there we go. And as you can see, here is the animation and the settings right here. And we have the frames bottom here. And as we at the top, um, we have these. And just want to turn off this for our alpaca logo so it doesn't have the alpaca logo on the side and i'm just gonna choose my fps which is how many frames per second is it going through and then i'm just gonna get 30 fps and then i just want to click um create gif animation and I'm just, i'll be back when it's finished loading after that's done this thing is going to pop up and you just want to click on okay download it and it should take us to another page and I'm loading and you just want to click on here to download and here's the page and so basically you just want to right click and save image as and it should you just want to save it where you want to save it so I'm just going to save it on my ball and name this ball Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna name this ball now, okay. Ball. And... Okay. After it's done downloading, you just wanna open it where you left the file in. So, I'm just gonna open the admin machine right now. Okay, there we go. And we have our animation finished. In a GIF, I guess. Um, sorry for if it looks so bad because I'm doing a quick one, and I think this only took like around 30 or an hour. I right? <laughs> probably I haven't look, I haven't looked at the time, but as you can see, in the it's it's not that bad, I guess. Um, it's a quick one. So, anyways, I really appreciate it if you would um. Hit that like button and subscribe and turn on post notifications because I sometimes upload like in a week or so. And anyways, can you please like share this video? <laughs> and why? Um, so basically, 
Why did I upload this video? Well, you see... It's a school project. Bruh!